Hell yeah, what's up guys? It's Curse Pike. My friends call me Big C. Back in action today, I got something crazy to show you. And if you're a TikTok dancer, you're going to want to turn this video off right now because <laughs> it's coming for you. But here's the thing. I'm going to show you how to take any image, literally any type of image, and animate it in a cartoon. This is not taking a video and turning it into a cartoon. I'm going to show you how to do that as well. But this is an image into a cartoon and then into an animated cartoon in a style of your choice. For example, and I'll give you the example running behind me. I've got an image of this white lady here doing her thing. She's just a regular white lady. I put the image in. I put the video of this Asian girl doing some weird dance thing going on. I hit the button and all of a sudden I've got a cartoon of that white girl doing the dance that the Asian lady was doing. And I can download it and use it, upload it to YouTube and it's gonna pass all the copyright checks. This is nuts. Let me show you how to do this. All right, first step, head over to Google or whatever you use and type in Domo AI. When you get there, you want to make sure that you select the second result, at least for me. You want Domo AI dot app, not AI dot Domo dot com. Totally different sites. Same name. Kind of weird. Click on that and then presto, you're going to see this. It's going to ask you to join your discord. So you're going to join up with discord and then I'll show you in discord what the next steps are. All right, here we go. So we are in Domo AI, and just keep in mind that it's this robot icon. If you're not sure and you get lost, it's the robot icon right here. And then you get a whole bunch of options, but what we want to do is we want to go to one of the generate rooms here. So there's 11 generate rooms. I'm going to go to generate video 11, and you can already see here that here's an example of what I did earlier. So I added this woman here. This is just a stock image. And then I added this video here of this girl dancing, which is the stock video, and it gave me this which is pretty damn impressive. I am not going to lie. This is crazy. Okay, so how did I do that? Well, let's just go right to the bottom here. I'm just going to grab this and pull it down. And then here we go. So the first step is you want to go forward slash move. And when you do that, hit enter. You get two options. You get to upload a video and you get to upload the image. So let's start with the video. So I'm going to go ahead and grab this video here. And just so you know, this is the video of that Asian lady dancing. That's her dancing. And now I'm going to grab the image. So I'm just going to click on that again. And then I'm going to go to movies. And I've got an image that I want to use. Let's use this lady here. We've got a nice attractive lady here with a nice smile. So we're basically saying, hey, I want this lady, and this is also a stock image, to take this image and turn it into a dancing video like this. Crazy. I know. All right. So in the prompt section here, all you got to do is type in what you want. Attractive lady dancing doesn't have to be too specific because it's more or less using um, the the video instead of what your prompt says hit enter and now you're going to get a couple options it's going to take a few seconds for it to think about what we're doing here but here we go domo ai is thinking all right i'm going to come back when it's done some thinking show me a second that's already done okay good enough now look at this we get a few different options here here we go so it defaults to anime style but there is a realistic model as well so I'm going to go with the anime version six, but there are four different styles. I recommend you try out all of them. They're all really, really good. Let's go with the anime style. Secondly, we can go for a three second video, a five second video, a 10 second video, or a 20 second video, believe it or not. Uh, do keep in mind that the 20 second video takes 20 minutes to render. And I believe the big one is only for paid subscribers. So I have a I have a paid subscription to this, but you'll only probably have the first three. So let's go ahead and click on 10 seconds here, generate 10 seconds. And then literally all you got to do is hit start and it's going to start cooking. And then I'm going to come back in a few minutes and I'll show you what we got. All right. Welcome back. So here we go. Here's the original image, which we put in there. A nice lady having a nice smile. Plus the dancing lady, full body dancing, only half of her body showing in this picture. But look at this. If I click on this here and I click and play, there we go. We've got our, she's got the same kind of shirt on and then it gave her some matching pants <laughs> and there she is doing her thing, dancing away. And if I want to download them, look here, you'll see here that it gives you the results. It gives you the original image and the video that you can go ahead and download if needed. So really, really cool stuff. Now I want to show you how to change one type of video into another. It's cool. Watch this. All right. Welcome back. So the next thing I want to show you is how to take a video and change its style. So let me show you what I'm talking about here. Here's a video of this, you know, pretty lady just sort of looking back and then 
like all women do, looking away and walking away from me. <laughs> okay, this is just a okay. This is just a uh, stock video. This isn't real life. <laughs> but here you go. I've turned this into this style, literally with one click. Now her left eye has a little bit of a wobble there, but I mean this is pretty cool. It's even borderline uh, Grand Theft Auto Five style. So let me show you how to do this. It's easy as heck to do. All you got to do is just type in forward slash video and then hit enter. Once you do that, it says drag and drop a video you want to select. I'm going to go ahead and select, I don't know, let's select a puppy dog here. We're going to get this pupperoo and we're going to drag and drop in this puppy that just does puppy things. Now for the prompt, this isn't a big deal, but I'm just going to be like cute puppy. That's it. I don't have to do anything really. It doesn't really even matter, but you got to put something in here. So I'm going to hit enter. And now when I do this, check this out this is where it gets kind of crazy so first thing like always you can go ahead and select 3 5 10 or 20 seconds if you have a paid subscription you can also refer to source video more which is what i almost always recommend or refer to prompt more if you've got a bad video i suppose but anyways when i click on this down arrow you'll see here that there is not just like one style there are 23 different styles. Van Gogh, paper art, Grand Theft Auto game, color illustration, storybook, comic, pixel, 3D cartoon, Chinese ink painting, anime of all different types and flavors. I mean, just tons of stuff here. So 2.5D illustration style is one of the newer styles, PlayStation 2 style, color pencil style, just altogether amazing stuff. I'm going to go ahead and select uh, 2.5D illustration style because I find this to be quite good. But again, you can always experiment, try out the different styles. There's 23 of them. I'm going to go ahead and select a five second version of this. And it says here it should take about five minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and click start. And then we're going to render this one out and we'll see what it looks like when I come back. All right, welcome back. So here we go. Here's another example. I've got my puppy dog doing puppy dog things here. Just just being a boss. And then I click out and then bang, here we go. We've got our pupper doing some Grand Theft Auto-y, illustration-y uh, animation type things. And the same thing goes for this uh, pretty lady, which I think I showed you earlier. And then here she is in sort of like a line drawn Grand Theft Auto style. So this is all one click, easy to do. Let me show you one more thing you can do with this product though. All right, so the last thing I wanna show you is you can actually make your content with a green background, for example. So if you wanna, you know, chroma key or green screen or pull out the green color you can do that as well let me show you example i'm going to go forward slash move i'm going to hit enter and then you'll see video and image so let's do the same thing again i'm going to grab let's go for the video we're going to have that lady doing her dance thing drag and drop it there for an image i'm going to use this image of livy dunn because she's very pretty and that's just how i roll but watch this under prompt i'll have pretty woman dancing and then this is what I'm going to do, dash, dash, K-E-Y, or dash, dash, key. When I do that and hit enter, there we go. So we'll see here that it's going to go ahead and it allows me to do five seconds, three seconds, etc. I'm going to do five seconds on this one. I'm going to go anime, Japanese style anime, and then I'm just going to click on start. All right, and here is some green screen action. Here we go. Here's a picture that I used. It's Livy Dunn, the uh, gymnast. It's a terrible picture. It's low quality, but hey, that's okay. I just wanted to show you what this is capable of doing. So there's the image. There again is our little dancing lady that does her silly dance. And now look at this. Here's the animation. But look, it's got green screen in the back. So if you know how to chroma key or green screen... You could just pull out the green and then you've got the dancing character with no background, which is awesome, especially if you like to create motion graphics that are kind of funny and quirky. So there you go, guys. This is all inside Domo AI. I got a link in the description below. Give it a try. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thanks for watching.